Hi, it's Nancy, the Over 40 Princess, and I am here today to do Hair Tuesday. And no, this is not the look. I did this look with my flat iron because I wanted some straight, some curled, lots of volume, because we're going to be doing a really neat look today with something that everybody's afraid with. Are you ready? Don't be scared. Don't. Don't. Just, just don't scream. I, I can't stand screaming. The big moment. That's right. The one you gave to their kids to turn into Transformer toys. We're going to play with it. I'm not quite sure how this is going to turn out because I've never used it before. But I've got a really good idea. Oh, here we go. Now, the look is Bridget Bardot on the beach. And there's a very famous picture of her in a beach and black dress that's very similar to this with very similar makeup and I'm going to do a hairstyle reminiscent of her but remember we don't live in 1961 anymore so dippity doo is not a part of this on any way shape or form um, what is a part of this is a can of hairspray your heat protectant of course brush a comb for teasing hair. Oh no! You're ugly and has foot ends! No, not that kind of teasing. A couple of clips. Two bobby pins. Yeah, more if you want. Kind of a little clip. Yeah, I can leave the little clip, but I like the little clip because, you know, we're on the beach and things might blow. We don't want our hair to blow. Okay, enough of that. Bridget Bardot, let's talk about her for a real sec quick second here. Bridget was, is still alive, lives in one of her many homes all over Europe. And she's a political activist, animal rights activist. Um, doesn't have much good to say about France anymore and how it's lost its uh, je ne sais quoi. Uh, she's, um, she says even the French prostitutes aren't the same as they used to be. And she had spunk and fight and attitude and lots and lots and lots of affairs and made over 50 movies. And in 1972, she did what other actresses don't do. She retired. I love it. So, before we start our hair, the African Black Soap Report. This is datum two on the African Black Soap from Coastal Scents. No, my skin has not sloughed off. I have not turned into some weird kind of red monkey. And no, I am not broken out in bizarre zits that I've never seen before. In fact, my skin was actually clear this morning. We're holding off on that part until we see if it works better. I've made my husband use it. i forced my children to use it. And I've convinced all of the boys it has elephant poop in it. That's worth it for the 10 bucks alone that they're washing their faces with elephant poop. So when you get done with your hair, curling it, this is going to be very kind of... um. I don't know. It's it's like a dressy beach look. It's it's just how they did it back in the '60s. I remember having dinner once. We were in Jamaica, and this is like one of like the big moments of my life. I met Maria Tolchi's passion after she divorced George Balanchine. And if you don't know who they are, look up ballerinas on the net. Okay, and I just lightly sprayed it because I still want to be able to get, you know, smooth a little bit. But this is a pretty rough textured look. I'm going to pull my hair forward at the crown. The only concern I have with this bump it is that I don't have a lot of hair in the front. So I'm going to have to take it up from the sides without going overboard. So we're just going to take this and just... I'm going to take the part behind the bumpet, which is not what you normally tease, and just tease a little bit of hair down. Now, sure, you could get this look by teasing a whole lot of hair down, but, pardon me, I dropped my comb. Why hold a lot of hair down when you can just hold a little? This is going right at the crown of my head. Okay. Here comes Bride. Bardot was sexy, 
not afraid of her sexuality as many women in France were not and are not. She was like a size four six today. I mean, she was small, but she wasn't. I think she's closer to like what we call a six. I really do. Just looking at her. You know who she reminds me of when I look at her? And this is just really bizarre. She reminds me of Fergie. She really does. She's her delicious. Um, I have it. The reason I just ran it, I stuck a little right there. Claw clip in the back was to see what it was doing before I clip clipped it. And I like it. And it is not showing through got a hair on a place there on the top. I can feel one of the bumps right here. But it's not showing through. If you get them to match your hair, they really don't show through. Um, and I know I've had my kids look at them. My husband will lie to me, my children won't. I want to push this hair forward. Yeah. Clip in the back. Now, Beachy. I had the two clips just in case. I'm not going to need them. Now, I could have put another bump right behind this one. I put a smaller bump in front and bigger bump in back. You can do that. I've seen it done. It looks really cute. It's just a little much. Where on earth would you wear this? To an art gallery opening, of course. Makes perfect sense to me. Okay, the clips, or the bobby pins, excuse me. Put them in more see bouquet. Or in case you want to pull the front over. Which is more formal. But I think Oh my gosh, how 80s. I'm teasing my bangs, only I did it much tighter. I just want to get some fluff in them. I am not going for those funky bangs that they had that kind of stood up here. You know, we're watching, you know, we're going to a poison concert! Ah! <laughs> I need one of those hairspray shields. Snuff that. By the way, the hairspray is Style by Sammy. And it is the Just Hold Me. It says it's Extreme Hold, Extreme Shine. I found it has Extreme Shine as far as the hold goes. It's not so uptight. I mean, I can still feel hair. Real hair. If a man wanted to come up to me and touch my hair, he wouldn't hear it crunch. And that's a good thing. Um, one of the things you definitely, definitely want to do with this style is come down. You've got a side tendril or two. You have to your finger. Just kind of let it go. Just in front. That. It's your Bridget Bardot inspired look. Hair. Bridget. And it's possible to do it with a slightly smaller bump, but you know what? It just doesn't give it the drama that the big bump it does. And again, this kind of hairstyle, it gives you a je ne sais quoi. And play with your hair and your makeup. Mm -hmm.